What's up, everyone? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to wherever you are right now. Glad to have you here with us. So let's get right to it. First up, Pablo. It's been such a joy to witness his double album release. Seeing him so happy and fulfilled lately is honestly heartwarming. From his interviews with Boy Abunda <laughs> to his mall tours for the album, and even his appearance on The Voice Kids. You can tell how much he's grown and how hard he's worked. I mean, we've talked about how much responsibility he carries, but it's clear that he's in a good place right now, and he deserves every bit of happiness that comes his way. And let's talk about how incredible these albums are. One is full of his pain and struggles. <laughs> While the other is about gratitude and finding joy in life, it's like a perfect yin and yang. Together, you know, uh, they really show the full spectrum of what Pablo has been through, from the darker moments to the brighter, more uplifting ones. It's amazing how everything he releases feels so carefully crafted. His thought process and attention to detail are just on another level. Pablo never puts out anything without real intention behind it. And it's one of the many reasons why his music resonates so deeply with us. So to our Pinuno, congratulations and thank you for your music. And that backflip, Jesus, please be careful. And then there's Stell, who recently addressed the hate he's been receiving during his TikTok live. Alam ko naman na ngayon, parang ang daming nangyayari, ang daming mga bagay na di natin makokontrol. Unang-una, um, gusto ko sabihin na, of course, thank you sa inyo kasi alam ko naman na super protective kayo, super concerned, and ako, sa akin lang naman, with all the things happening right now, parang nasabi ko naman na sa inyo na hindi naman ako tinatablan ng kahit ano pa ng mga bashing or anything. Hinahayaan ko na lang sabihin ng mga tao yung mga um, negative, negative things na gusto nilang sabihin about me. Kasi unang-una, ba't naman ako masasaktan kung hindi naman totoo? Kung ginagamit nila for for cloud or kung kinagamit nila just to make fun of me yung mga bagay-bagay para iba siya ko so let them be pag uh, hindi natin pinansin tas ma-feel nila na parang ah wala na palang effect parang sila na lang yung mapapagod so hayaan na lang natin sila honestly to those immature people attacking him you probably haven't even accomplished half of what Stell has in his career Pagka nag-open ako ng Facebook, talaga nakikita ko. Especially yung picture nga na kumakalat. Yung ginagamit talaga ng lahat for to make fun of me. Picture ko nung parang pre-debut ba namin yun o debut namin na photo. Ginagamit na sa kahit saan. Sa mga memes, sa mga kung ano-anong bagay. Kinocompare nila sa ibang mga artists, ibang pipap idols. Tapos parang sinasabi nila maasim, ganun-ganun. And 
ako, hindi naman ako, hindi ako nasasaktan kasi parang unang-una sa lahat, proud ako dun sa photo na yun. All the energy being used to post old photos and drag him down? Use that to work on yourselves instead. The thing is, no matter how hard they try, it won't change how we see him. We've loved Stell before, and we love him now. And you know what I admire most about Stell? It's his maturity and grace in dealing with these trolls. Proud ako doon sa picture na yun kasi kahit anong gawin natin, part pa rin siya ng past ko. And proud ako doon kasi yun yung reason bakit ako nandito ngayon. Merong ganong klaseng style, kaya merong style na ganito ngayon. So parang for me, pag nakikita ko yung photo na yun, I feel proud and I feel, you know, I feel happy sa kung ano ako ngayon. He doesn't lash out. He just handles it with so much love and respect and it only makes us admire him even more. The more they attack him, the more we're reminded of how amazing he is as a person. To 18, I know it's tough to ignore trolls, especially when the words they use can really hurt. But honestly, let's do our best to block them and move on. Let's not give them the attention they're looking for. Instead, let's flood our timelines with the good that SB19 brings into our lives. We have the power to outshine the negativity by focusing on all the wonderful things the boys have done. And please, um, let's not fall for those rage baits, especially when they start comparing groups or idols. We're better than that, and I know we can stay above it. Um, if they nila tayo pababa, hayaan mo sila. Mapagod sila kakahila sa atin pababa kasi never naman tayo bumababa. Patuloy tayong umaangat kasi alam natin mabuti yung ginagawa natin. So, that's fine. Mas ma mas masarap matulog sa gabi na alam mong wala kang inaapakang tao. Di ba? Mas masarap matulog sa gabi. Mas masarap gumising sa umaga pag alam mong maraming taong nagaantay sa iyo and excited kang makita. Mas yun yung mas mahalaga. Yung mga ganung klaseng tao, hayaan niyo na kasi for sure may gagawin si God sa kanila. So, yeah. That's it for this video. Thank you guys again for keeping up with our channel and for all the positive comments we've been getting. We are truly grateful. Also, uh, we have a um, very inactive Twitter account, but we want to use it for our giveaways. So communication with the winners will be easier. If you guys have a second, please do follow us. Uh, especially if you're interested in joining or just want to chat and share SB19 thoughts, it would be really cool. We have another giveaway coming up, so please stay tuned for that. Thank you, everyone, and stay safe out there.